Scotch broom? That's a very big question. <laughs> I think Scotch broom could be one of the worst plants I've ever met in my life. I'm one of those crazy people that likes broom. Well, it's a beautiful plant, beautiful flower. I've killed a lot of them. I think it's been given a bad name. That there's a question of ecological balance. Oh my God, lots of broom. Well, they're an invasive exotic species. Broom seed, as you probably well know, lasts in the ground for like up to 30 to 60 years, it can lay dormant. So, and there's each plant's producing 18,000 seeds. If you pull it, you create a bit of disturbance and the seeds love disturbance, so they will germinate. And they, they thrive in those areas and they can outcompete uh, almost any other native plant. Well, it's uh, stifling natural processes, natural succession in, in lots of situations. And uh, in this area, there's the, the endangered, threatened Gary Oak ecosystems, Gary Oak Meadows, where we have uh, over a hundred rare uh, or listed species in these ecosystems. So where you have many different kinds and lots of diversity, you end up with one species. So that's why we pull it out. <laughs> maintain diversity. Uh, well, this is my war. <laughs> Damn broom. It's acidifying the soil here. And it's, I'm happy to get rid of it. There's something quite satisfying actually about putting all of your weight and all of your force into something and being able to pull as hard as you possibly can and you know, reefing on it, reefing on it and pulling back and then it pops out of the ground and you feel this sense of like, ha, conquering, victory. When I think of the Cooper's hawks, the crickets, the, all the lilies and shooting stars, it just, just infuriates me that some idiot brought this stuff over. It's invaded and it's a bugger to get out. They were brought here, I believe I heard someone say, in the 1850s. But we can trace it back to that one gentleman in Souk who brought some seeds over on a boat from uh, Hawaii. I always thought it came directly from Scotland, but the story is it came from Hawaii. Two seeds he planted in Souk, and uh, birds didn't you know, fly across the oceans with little scotch broom seeds in their mouths. Uh, it was a, or a little sprig of scotch broom uh, you know, it was us. It was humans. Some people think that that human beings are a little bit of a weed species on the planet in terms of the way we've you know, we've really taken over. And we both like proliferating and colonizing and uh, and and spreading. With our concrete and our road building, our uh, voracious appetite for lumber and clear cuts and building houses and our dumps and, you know, just completely altering the landscape, fracturing the landscape. There's a part of them that is probably feeling guilty about their own invasiveness and um, and it's kind of like our, our their shadow side and it's coming out by this, this angry desire to just get rid of it because it's within themselves so it's this kind of warlike mode and you get kind of violent and the, you pull on the broom and the broom doesn't come out and so you get angry at it and then you start pulling harder and, and so it actually gets me into a, a probably more sort of violent state of feeling than almost anything else in the world there's not that many other things I kind of set myself against the way I have at times set myself against broom. and that it's not necessarily by pulling out and killing another species that we're going to heal that relationship with Earth. Yay! Are we gonna take spaceships to Mars? Are we gonna go to the moon and try to grow it organically there? Uh, I think it's uh, better if we just you know, take a step back Stop spreading around the broom and uh, 
try to heal this planet because it's the spaceship we got and I'd like to stick with it. I don't know, broom, what can you do with broom? I've heard with broom that you can, uh, if, you, if you pick off all the flowers, you can compress it and then you can smoke it and it's a hallucinogenic plant. So there you go. <laughs> Maybe there's a market there for uh, broom somewhere. <laughs> <laughs>